Pope Francis brought together all administrative and financial activity within the Vatican under a single department. The new Secretariat for the Economy will have Sydney Cardinal George Pell as its first prefect. With this latest step, Pope Francis simplified the structure of the administrative aspect of the Holy See, making it easier to avoid mistakes and to review financial activities. Until now, each of the 230 Vatican entities had a separate budget and accounting system, and they used different administrative methods to manage their budgets and accounts. We're dealing with a wider structure which affects all the other administrative structures within the Holy See. Here we're talking about all the institutions that have a financial or administrative aspect. So from now on, they will be under the guidance of this new body, which has a wider scope. George Pell will in effect be the new manager. His experience includes putting in order two of the biggest dioceses in Australia. He will answer directly to the Pope and will implement any changes as recommended by the Council for the Economy, which the Pope also introduced. It's made up of eight cardinals and seven lay experts from around the world. We have two new bodies, which are the Secretariat for the Economy, which is the operating body, with Cardinal George Pell as the prefect, and a Secretary General to be named later. And then there's the Council for the Economy, with 15 members. In addition, the Pope will name an Auditor General, which will have access to all institutions of the Holy See and the Vatican City State. With his latest decision, Pope Francis aims to combine and maximize resources in order to serve the common good and the full development of the human person.